My superstar panel returned. Carol Malone, your nominee for Greatest Britain, please. OK, Boris is my Greatest Britain, one of the most brilliant politicians of our generation. He pulled out of the race um, yesterday gracefully and magnanimously because he knew he'd get... He had enough backers to get on the ballot paper, but, and, he, but he, and he knew the Tories MPs would vote against him, but the party would vote for him. That was going to cause chaos, so he said that he can't rule... Um, you know, with, with that kind of mess. And so he pulled out. So on, on that basis, you know, yeah, that is my greatest Britain. He's Nigel Nelson, you're on the country. Yep, coming in the other way is Keir Starmer uh, for oh. calling for the general election the nation absolutely craves. Belinda De Lucy, your nominee, please. My nominee is the Reform Party for not packing up in 2020 when the UK officially left the EU, but for keeping the home fires burning and waiting in the wings for a moment we might need them. Thank you for giving us a choice come next election reform. And I am told their memberships are soaring uh, tonight. But I'm going to go with Boris Johnson as greatest Britain because my reasoning is that, you know what, uh, regardless of what the MPs think, if he had been on the ballot, he would have won and yeah. he would have been the party's best hope of defeating Labour at the next election. So more fool them. Union jackass time now. Carol Malone, your nominee. Ironically... My jackass is Boris. What? <laughs> yeah, that's because I don't, because as much as I, I, I like Boris, I don't think Sunak is right for the job. I listened to all Boris's reasons for backing out. He didn't want to reignite the turmoil. However, I think he's letting a lot of people down. Yeah, letting yeah. the members down. He's letting okay. the red wall, he's letting the red wall down. A lot of Nigel people Nelson, you Yeah, it, it, mine are the, uh, just stop oil protesters for throwing chocolate cake, uh, at the oh. person who is probably one of the greatest, uh, oh, champions. my goodness. Let's have a quick look at this. Idiots. Belinda and Lucy, your nominee. Has to be Martin Croxall, the presenter, uh, the BBC presenter, who got all tickled pink at the very idea of Boris leaving and uh, just proved to everyone watching the climate in the BBC is one where you feel you can get a free pass for being oh, very yeah, let's look biased. at this. Let's look at this. Again. Well, this is all very exciting, isn't it? Hello and welcome to our look ahead to what the papers will be bringing us tomorrow. Am I allowed to be this gleeful? Well, I am. No, you're not. And she's been suspended, and I think that is absolutely the right decision. But do you know what? I'm going to go with Nigel Nelson today because these Just Stop Oil maniacs targeting King Charles, do they not know? He's the biggest no. green loony out there, for goodness sake. Uh, Nigel.